right. So overall, um, it's a classic film. I gave it uh, maybe a little bit too high. I gave it a 7 out of 10. Uh, the pacing is pretty decent for the film. Uh, the kills I liked, mostly because of those special effects. Um, and wherever the jump scares were, they did get me, uh, especially the, the Kevin Bacon one. Um, <laughs> that, that was a good one. And, of course, Jason at the end in the water. Now, I'm going to ask you an actual question because I watched this movie last year mm -hmm. and my reaction was, this is so boring. Can this end already? It's so dry. On my first watch through, it was like that. But the second time, this this is only my second time watching the film. I, I liked it. I had a good time. Now, is that because you and I were taking notes and this movie is just nice to take notes because you can kind of not have to pay attention at all times? That might be it. We're going to have to see when we do the rest of the films to see how this one holds up. So for this one, it was clear they had a bigger budget because of how successful the first one was. Um, they had a bigger cast, so like more people in the film, which was, you know, more money. Uh, there was better lighting. The sets looked a lot better. The camera quality. They had a script. <laughs> yeah, they finally had a script, arguably. Um, to me, there wasn't much put into that script. It felt like they took what was successful in the first one, which were most of the same exact deaths or in, in those lines. It just In the vein. Yeah. It felt like the same formula. I don't know. It... It wasn't as enjoyable. I liked Ginny more than Alice because of more character they gave to her. Um, and but see, that wasn't just Ginny, though. Every character in this movie was a version of a character from the first movie if they had a character. Yeah. I don't know. There were also some questionable editing choices clearly in this movie. Um, okay. So here's my question. Yeah. Questionable editing choices. <laughs> And yet, like in the first movie, we have a cop eating shit <laughs> or like barely eating, like about to eat shit. We have random fucking like cuts of people. Like anytime someone would drive away in the first movie, it was like an awful editing. I'm not. Camera work was way worse in the first movie. I'm not saying the first movie's great by any means because it's not. I did give it what, like a seven out of ten because it was the only one I've seen Yes, yeah, it was just does number one change does number one change at least in the rating of a out of 10. Yeah, it's probably down to like a five, maybe a okay. six. Good. This one Good. I gave a four out of 10. It's not terrible, but <laughs> it's not great. You just sat there and just went, this movie's better in every way. <laughs> it's a four. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You just counter. You just, <laughs> what did you just do? I don't know. You just sat there and went, this You're movie's right. better. It has a better script, has a better <laughs> plot, has a better final girl, has better kills, has a better budget, has all the stuff that's better, but somehow it's worse. <laughs> I don't know. I just didn't. What the actual fuck? I, I but I will say this. I like. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call you out right now. <laughs> I like. That in this, that for this episode, you remained consistent with your opinion. <laughs> Unlike last episode, where you were like, I hated it. The quality is better. <laughs> Everything about it's better. This movie's so much better. And then, like, 10 seconds later, you're like, it's just worse, you know? <laughs> it's just like, it got worse. Like, How? It's not as good I don't know. As the first movie. And, I'll, and I'm listening to this, and I'm like, Okay, RJ, just remember, she was sleep deprived <laughs> while we were filming this episode. This is probably where the sleep deprivation really hit I'm us. I'm going to go with that. I'm going to keep that as my defense. <laughs> and then, like, I try to, like, stand up for you at the end. I'm like, so let me get this. Like, let me try to point this out. And I'm like, you didn't have to do that. Because when I was editing the episode, I was like, she dug herself in this hole. How dare I she? I think the worst part is I knew I did, too. And I was like, I'm just going to keep rolling with it. <laughs> I can't backtrack now. So you gaslit me. Is <laughs> 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 it thinking you didn't mean that? <laughs> oh. oh. Oh, my goodness. You know what? No, number three is the best movie. Period. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. I can't do that. All right, movie roundup. This movie sucks. Paige, what did you think? I second that. 
<laughs> and we're done. <laughs> <laughs> we have to go a little bit. I mean, uh, let's try to make it a minute. Let's try to make it a right, minute. All okay? right, let's do it. We let's got try to make this. this a minute. Camera, worse. Audio, worse. <laughs> Acting, so much worse. So much worse. By page logic, this movie should get like a 10 out of 10. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, this movie gets like a two. The deaths are good. Thank you, Tom. This movie gets a three. <laughs> I think I think with the deaths, I'm gonna be honest. It's it's gonna be a three for me. Um, it's if I so had to describe this movie in two words, boring and pointless. Um, like I if s- I had to describe this movie in two words, it would be fuck this. Like-